Hey everyone, in this case you will be able to learn about how to send in your uh, data from the send up into the send in and to the another activity. So here, this is our latest uh, previous video that we already learned about the send up. So we're going to try again. I'm here to be you mean at gmail.com and you one two three and the password is kkkkk okay and i'm going to register and should be new data here okay so after we already have the data we need to make sure that the data is really exists so how to that how to do that it's gonna be because we want to make the send in send in screen so here i will go to design and in, in the register we can copy and paste and move the below here uh sorry i i'm wrong to move this one okay and i will move here 32 okay and this is the button to the send in so i will setting the node to the bottom and this is 32 and we're going back to the text and double click here to get this source code and then here i will change it to the send in okay and i want to make a difference so we use the color primary and change the text color to be white okay so we already have register and send in and whenever you click the send in you can go to the another activity which, which is uh, uh, which is the send in so we can easily well i'm gonna to prepare so we're going to the java new and activity and empty activity and here login activity okay and finish okay now we just need to copy the layout from the activity underscore mine just uh, but firstly here double click we need to declare the id btn to send in okay and then we can copy all of this and go to activity login and paste all of them okay and in the activity login we need to change this label to the send in and here we don't need again about the email address so just use the username and password we just delete this email address and select the username and click here and here and go to design and select this username and setting the margin top is 32 like this and going back to the text and click here double click and change it to the btn send in and then change the label to the login and then in the bottom here we need to change to btn to send sorry to send up okay and here should be new label create a new account so when i click this it's going back to the here but if i click the send in it's going to the here okay it it is make sense yeah well after that we just need to go to main activity and here we need to declare new button which is btn to send in all right and after that we can easily copy this btn here btn to send in and this is the id is btn to send in and we need use the intern btn send in set on click okay and intern s new intern get application context and then go to login activity class okay and start activity s okay so let's try to 
the emulator so whenever I click the send in it should be to the another activity which is send in so whenever I log in and we need to validation with the Firebase database okay so here we're going to the login activity firstly we're gonna to import the Firebase Google you know and don't forget to import the model user here this is the model user and this is the Google Firebase okay and after that we need to copy from here yeah I think that all of them is same so we just need to copy and then we can here and okay and I don't need BTN send up and I don't need BTN send in we just need to BTN send in okay and we don't need any email because we just need to use the username and the password okay and after that we can go into the main activity again and I'm going to copy this and here we move to the protect for it and we don't need email and here should be change sent in and here btn no not to sign in just btn sign in okay and we need to create the on click listener the event for the send in so btn send in set on click listener and then here we need to create the function which is send in so just send in and edit username uh, do you remember the last one which is get text and to string comma and edit password and get text and to string okay now the send is highlighted by red because we haven't created the uh, function so we just need I'll enter and create method send in with the login activity okay and here should be changed because user name and this is password okay and after that don't forget to setting it to the final because we want to access it from the outset function parameter so here should be users at listener for the single value listener okay and here we need to create the validation with the if and else we just need to make sure that our data which is username and password is exist into our firebase but if it doesn't exist so we can make the notification like the toss okay so let's do that here should be if data snapshot and chilled by the user is exist so I think here we need to make sure why it's oh okay we set in the username here okay so here if the username doesn't uh, empty so we can user by using the model and login and then data snapshots and then chilled by the username and then get value user by the model and class okay and we need to create the validation again if login get the password and the password is correct okay so we can use the task success login all right but if wrong else task password is wrong all right this is about username is empty but what if username doesn't register so here should be else and task 
username is not registered is not registered all right and you can custom the code again okay and yeah i think just try just try it first into the emulator now i'm going to uh, register a new account first here amelia at gmail.com amel and the password one two three and then we can register and we already have new data which is amel and then i want to try to send in with the email amel one two three and then just login and success login if you are already success login you should go another activity now i will create the dummy activity so to be here just click right new and activity and the empty activity and this is the home activity okay and finish now i'm going to the xml just yeah just say hello why not so we can click here and move to the center where is the center oh what's okay this one and i will click here and go into the text and here welcome to the home text size is 22 sp okay so this is the home the home screen now we're going back to the login activity and going to the main activity and maybe you already create the intern here that we can copy and going to the login activity and looking for the success login and here we're gonna to pass okay and here should be home activity and now we're going to run this application again now i'm going to send in and here with the id amel and one two three and login and success login and welcome to the home so this is the login working with the firebase well i think it's enough so don't forget to like comment and share it to your friends and nice to meet you from indonesia thanks everyone goodbye